Hello, welcome to Wild Dagger TV. A little salute there to all my new subscribers and my new likes and my new comments. Thank you very much. Um, done a review on this uh, FTX Ravine. We've uh, and we've got the controller for it, which is very useful, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Right. Um, we did just put a 2S in it and melt the ESC, so it's got a steering wheel on it, everybody, which steers the wheels, doesn't it? Yes. Right, okay, so uh, check out the video, see what you think. Do a review on the kitchen worked off, and then I've just brought it out, took it for a good run, put a 2S in it, and melted it. Thanks for talking about Hello, Wild Dogger TV. Welcome to... Uh, one of my first proper reviews, I'm going to try and do a proper little review on this because these are quite cheap at the moment. Get them in your local hobby shop or hobby store or RC shop or whatever you want to call it, your model shop or whatever, wherever you call it where you are. You can pick up this uh, FTX uh, Ravine, I think it's a Ravine, yeah Ravine, yep, yeah, look, FTX 2.4 gigahertz. So, first looks first impressions tires supple enough nice and squidgy come back to life gonna fill with water as soon as you head for some water body yeah. it's quite flimsy but it's gonna take a hit so that's the idea of that good uh, what else have we got here nice uh, looks nice there's a general looking track. It looks very cool. Servo, 6Ks on the back. 6K on the front. Two nice shops. That's cool. It's actually on. Alright, we'll whip the body off. Voila. So just by magic, there it is. Here's the body. Look, quick look. No, it doesn't, 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 doesn't feel shit. Doesn't feel cheap. Actually, it's painted up nice as well. Looks quite smart. Drivers look cool. Could go to town a bit more on that if you wanted to. You know, four four pins on each side. Uh, two pins on each side. Four in total. Okay, runs on these, look, this is the actual battery out of this truck, yeah, it's on a little 6 volt at the moment, just for demonstration purposes, okay, uh, what have we got then, so, good articulation there, amazing art springs, good arms, a bit flimsy on the sides, but I suppose you want it like that, you don't want it to break, because I can squeeze that, look, nice tidy tucked away wires, So you get the power button here. Little motors in there, three AEs I believe. Um, this RTR comes, you know, ready to go. But this has a certain party trick. We will. I'm going to take this out at some point. So I know this is, this bit's going to be boring. I'll try not to rabble too much. But it has a party trick. Look. So steering settings. See. So, what are we on now? Let's steer the old steers. We're on the front steering, yeah? Now, little tip. When you take the body off, it goes on either way. So, to which, know which way is the front, because it both looks the same, both sides, look, all looks the same. Yeah? Just put it on front mode, look. The first mode is front. So that gives you your front. Then we'll flip it to the second mode. What's that give us? Oh, that gives us our um, four wheel steer, rear and front and rear. And then we got crab mode. It's quite quick as well, you know, it's actually very quick steering that. It's even working its way off the top, but ooh, 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 ooh. Right, right, stay there, stay there, stay there. Okay, and then the last one, which is just rear steer only. Yeah. 
here. And then back to front steer. Okay, overall, feels nice. Lots of options here there. Springs are good, definitely oil shocks. I know loads of people have said this, but I haven't said this. I love how it looks in here as well. It's done well. They've done well. No, it's done well. I haven't run it yet. It's got a bit of wind on it, but it hasn't been run yet properly. Yeah. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Well, chuffed with that. So, put on there like this. Da -da 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 -da. Four pin, there are two pins on either side. I keep getting that wrong. Shot like that. Yes, these are the most important things in life at the moment. Run, mayonnaise, and shit roll, apparently. In that order. Okay. It's quite quick, this thing as well, but I'm going to take it out for a run video. So this is going to be a day five slash six of lockdown. I'm going to take the dog for a walk. Take this with me. My dog's only got little legs, so it takes him a long time to catch up. Um, take it for a blip, see what it does tomorrow, see how it gets on. Um, so, um, in the spirit of, uh, how do they do this? How do you do a transition? Oh yeah, that's right. So, so far, typical FTX equipment, works well, doing the basics, so we'll find somewhere a little bit more difficult in a minute. It's quite quick for a little car, for a crawler anyway, Let's see what it's doing in a minute. No issues there, weapon. The old Cornish slate here. See how it does. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Yeah, cool. Let's get that shot again. Bring it around that. Slate is very slippery though. You say. Literally got minimal throttle on there, literally just tickling it along. Here's the dog. Considering it's on that slippery slate. It was doing very well. So, this is the th first time I used the rear wheel steer function on the truck. 
I've never actually uh, <laughs> tried it before, but as you can see, it snakes around a little bit. But it's got some good traction for a little light truck with only a tiny little battery in it. It does really well. I was very surprised. <laughs> Steer is very quick. Yeah. Come on. We've got two S for it. I think we'll put the two S in it in a second. Steer all right then. Come on. It is pissing down here as well. So it's not helping that many old slate. Oh. Maybe we can just cruise it this way there. Oh. Really? Come on. Ready, action! And to be fair to the missus, she has never used an RC car before and she did some brilliant driving, super impressed. giving his mum some support on his RC excursion. But yeah, as you can see, we haven't really put the ravine through you know, serious like paces, it. but we'll give it a good go. It's, it's done well. It's done very well. I'd just like to add another bit of voiceover here because I've worked out how to do voiceovers. So, uh, hello, this is my voiceover. in Ford so I've seen some big man-made holes so I'm not sure. There you go. The woman's screwing her face up because she doesn't know what a Ford is. She's like why has a big body of water got a hole in it? Never mind. Anyway, down there is a digger and over there is two diggers. Well done Goo. Oh shit nearly dropped my phone down the 
Oh, Danny O. So there you go, look, look at the view. You can see all of Cornwall today. All the important bits anyway. You alright, Doug?